say hey, babe. What's up? We're about to eat some uh, uh some pho right now. He usually got some pollito. I get some pollito and broccoli and white rice. And white rice. But I get my pho. I'm not too. I mean, I'm not too good. Not my choice though. But if they're like, you have to eat it or you'll die. Literally my favorite pho place has to be pho 88. You gotta tell them where though. Bishop Bart's. If you're from the cliff, I think you already know. What's up y'all? So we're at pho 88 here in Bishop Arts. And this is mustard. Yeah, so quick <laughs> quick little story time. I had an Uber driver and he sold mustard and he gave me this like sample to try, but I was a little scared to taste it because I was like, what if they drug me or something? You know, I don't know. She brought it to me and, and was I like, we had to taste it. I had it in my purse and I was like, look, this is the mustard. But anyway, I'm so excited to have some fun. It is a little chilly and it's like my go-to. Can you take your mask off so you oh, can yeah. see you? This is my boyfriend. Special guest for today's little mukbang. I wanted to What's do something up? different. I don't know. I love watching mukbang videos because they're just so interesting to me. I don't know She's how to say it. Mukbang, mukbang, whatever. I don't know. But yeah. It's just, I find it so weird. He thinks it's super weird, but I find it so interesting. <laughs> so I was like, why not do a little pho, my favorite food, mukbang video. I'm excited. He usually gets some uh, sesame, sesame chicken. chicken. With, I gotta have my sriracha sauce, my spicy sriracha, because you know, just adds a little flavor a to little, it. You know, a, a little, little, a little. You know. But yeah, he doesn't do the whole food thing. Nah, I don't. <laughs> so yeah, you guys, I'm so freaking excited. Yes. I'm starving. They like changed the time, so that kind of messed my schedule up. Mine too. I had a, I, yeah, a I didn't even know. Now. She told me earlier, like an hour ago. Yeah. Okay, so we got our spring rolls. Chicken spring rolls. I'm so I got my sriracha sauce. Yeah, he doesn't like the peanut sauce, but you can never go wrong with your peanut sauce. <laughs> Cucumber, chicken, carrots, cabbage, lettuce, um, lettuce. 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 And, and, rice noodles. and rice noodles. Bomb and stuff. <laughs> Paloma definitely put me on. Yeah, I'm the type of person that loves on. trying new food. Like, I'm open minded about it. I, it's just me. And when we started dating, he was not about that. All he ate were wings and tacos, literally. Still do. <laughs> but he's a little bit more open to my suggestions. <laughs> yeah, for real. I don't like seafood, and she had me try ceviche, and I liked it. Peruvian. Oh, Peru yeah, Peruvian. It had sweet potato. Peruvian ceviche. Our food is here, y'all. I'm so excited to eat. Look at this. Look I know, that. that looks perfect presentation. For Ten real. Out of 10. I, didn't, I didn't do this. This wasn't me. <laughs> okay. So we got our limoncito. Yeah, sorry. Que no falte el I have sriracha sauce. Oh. Alright. 
I always, always get the chicken pho. Always. I'll get the beef one every now and then, but my chicken is my go-to. This is definitely a... That's a little bit of sriracha. Can I have some more of yours? We'll ask for some more right now. I love my soup being spicy. Thank you. The broccoli is definitely good. Heaven. Definitely heaven. <laughs> so good. Mm. No? Yeah. Some no. Siento que me están mirando porque estoy grabando, pero no pasa nada. No pasa nada. ¿Qué va a pasar? Nada. Good, Dr. Pepper. Extra lime. Jalapeño. Uh, you hear me? It's good. Do Let's it. Let's try it. <laughs> that was a little spicy. Yeah? Mm hmm. <laughs> Super spicy. Not me. Don't catch me doing that. But that's weird because he cannot go without eating anything on salsa. <laughs> Literal, he has to eat everything on salsa. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> and it has to be spicy. So you know, no se lo come. Yep. Hence the spicy sriracha. They serve you a lot of food. For real. Look at this, y'all. I'm not nowhere near halfway there. I'm in Chile. Nowhere near halfway there. Nowhere near halfway. That makes sense, right? Yeah. Oh. Oh, you can see Minchile, but uh, that jalapeno was extra spicy. I didn't think it was going to be that spicy because usually the big ones are not as spicy. I bet you won't. One time for the one time. Go. Oh, 
whole lion man. <laughs> Did I get the seeds in? Look at my eyes, y'all. I'm not oh, kidding. Oh, no, wait. Nah, she's not lying. It like hits you afterwards. Yo, there's a bee. That's a bee. <laughs> yeah, leave it alone. Mm. Leave it alone and flicks it off. What the fuck, <laughs> Why? <laughs> that was stupid. <laughs> We're better. <laughs> you did it for the vlog, man? <laughs> Never in my life am I doing that again. I told you I didn't want to do it to begin with. For real. My tongue is real like burning right now, yo. <laughs> So bomb, make you want to shimmy your shoulder. Shoot. <laughs> you want to taste my chicken? Mm -mm. No, thank you. You want some? You want to try it? No. One time for the winter. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not worried about that. started talking she would always tell me about how she was all she was gonna bring me here she was gonna bring me here and now this is like our millionth time here it sure is <clears throat> because I'm I like I know like when she's having a bad day I just be like babe let's go to fuck and I mean the smile on her face he's not lying though <laughs> like is... for real this is like my comfort food it's like it makes me happy and i would always go on dates by myself before we started dating like i just loved going out to eat alone and so i would always tell him that this is one of my go-to places right and i was like you know like when you know when we go on a date or something we're like gonna go here and i'm gonna take you because i really really wanted him to try it. wanted him to try it and he loves it I mean, not specifically pho, but yeah. his chicken, sesame yeah. chicken, because the, ch the chicken here is bomb. It really is. I definitely recommend you guys coming. Not just the sesame chicken, but every yeah. Day. Um, I've had I've had quite a different things off the menu because you know. I you tried like, the kung pao here last time, no? One time. Was it? I think and it was then the I tried some kind of curry chicken. Everything is really good. They don't have general towels here, do they? No, I don't think so. Oh. General Tao's chicken is really good. But is that Vietnamese too? Hong Kong dragon? No, that's Chinese. That's food. Chinese? Yeah. Sorry, I don't know the difference. I'm still learning. It's okay. I'm just saying for those that watch this video and probably get offended by that. It's a beautiful day today, you guys. It really Weather's is, probably like what? 70, 65. It's popping. It's nice. Nah, it's, it's, yeah. it's like check, 60. Check. 
down. I don't want to put that bite down. Uh, <laughs> 63, close enough. And it's a Sunday. It is a Sunday. Cowboys play today. Tonight, they do. Tonight. We what's, up, what's up with them boys? That's what I want to know. What's up? <clears throat> I started watching football like that when we started dating. Cause, I, mean, I played soccer. I was a soccer girl. But what's up with them boys? <laughs> I mean, dead ass. I'm gonna tell you. What really hurt us. What really hurt us was that getting hurt and our defensive coach not producing not a damn thing. We got the players. <laughs> We have the players, we just don't have the discipline, and we don't have the right coaches coaching them up, because they look lazy, and they look scared to hit, and that's just coming from me, because I played ball, and I'm just saying, Cowboys don't want to try me out, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'll, I'll definitely go try out to be a safety, because right now, y'all need something. I run a 4-4, four -four. I, I can get up to about 195, and uh, I ain't scared to hit. I ain't no little punk. Defense is acting like some bunch of pussies right now. Excuse my language, but it's true. And that's just coming from a real fan. Well, damn. Our offense with Dak was producing 500 passing yards. Ezekiel Elliott needs to do something. And he needs to do something. Tony Pollard finna come up and take his spot. We need to have him in the game. Nico Elliott ain't doing nothing. Bro, you, you're a good player, but <laughs> you got to do something. No, but wow. Yeah. What about your soccer? I haven't kept up with anything, like, at all. Because you've been watching the Cowboys. I've been. I don't know what I've been doing. She jacked one of my jerseys. No, so let me tell you what happened. She jacked it. What had happened was... She stole it. I didn't. She no. stole it. Uh, She's no. <laughs> I was, ever since when, was it last year? Since last year, I had been borrowing it. Because I didn't have one. Like I, I love that word. I was borrowing <laughs> it, right? Staining it. It's a it. seasonal shirt. So anyway, or jersey. So anyway. Um, Cowboys is forever, baby. Oh, no. I forgot where I was going with this story. There's a saying. And it's a little cheesy because everybody knows it already, but win, lose, or tie. Cowboy fan, till I die. <laughs> Hopefully this rookie can do something. He needs to do something. I'm starting to get really full. And I'm going to show you how much is left. I'm still full steam ahead. Y'all look at this. I saw a lot of food, but it's just, they serve a lot. Which is not a bad thing at all. But I'm still in my head. Y está bien it barato. Bien barato. Yeah, it definitely hit the spot for today. For sure. Mm. You look mm. so good when you eat. Oh, yeah.